O'Reilly and Battelle state that Web 2.0 is all about harnessing collective technology. They make reference to the smartphone revolution and how it has moved the web from desktops into our pockets. Ultimately, they state that the web is no longer an industry, but, open quotations, a world, close quotations, of its own. They describe Web 2.0 as like a baby. It begins as slow and unintelligent, but as it learns, has the ability to become very smart and powerful. In fact, with modern day Web 2.0 applications such as Google, you are able to speak to your phone, which then links to the web, and the web is able to decode your voice and find the terms that you request. Therefore, Web 2.0 is far more than a simple catalogue, as it is able to understand and decrypt your own voice like another being. The sheer intelligence of Web 2.0 is demonstrated with applications such as Wikitude. This is an app that requires access to the internet and the camera, and you simply need to show it an area and it will work out where you are based on mapping algorithms with visuals, and then tell you about the points of interest nearby. This is only a small taste of the augmented reality style of future that we could be looking at for Web 2.0. One example which demonstrates the power and ability of Web 2.0 was the election of Barack Obama as US President. He and his team fully utilized the web in order to spread the word about his policies and his candidate status. Once more, O'Reilly and Patel state, open quotations, the web is no longer an industry, the web is now a world, close quotations meaning it has become far more than a simple broadcasting platform.